start in three, two, one, go. Team 2172 and 3954 in the red bumpers. Scoring cones for the Red Alliance in their grid. That'll give them an early advantage as we head into the two minute and 15 second student controlled teleoperated period. Team 59, near robot slingshot, trying to score a cone for the Red Alliance. Not quite where they wanted it, but still points nonetheless. That cone falls down to the low row in the Red Alliance grid. Looks like they found a cone nearby, making a second attempt, and there it goes. Five points for the Red Alliance. Team 3193, Falco Tech, scoring for the Blue Alliance effortlessly on the top row. Looking to cut down that red lead. Blue Alliance, the first to complete a link in this match. Team Elite now up on the Blue Alliance charge station, leveling it out as their alliance partners continue to score on the top and mid rows. Steel Unit E, arm up in the air, signaling to their human station player that they're ready for their next game piece. It looks like they will have their eyes set on a cone. The machine called Blitz, blitzes his way over on the far side of the field to the red grid, lifting that cone up towards a top row node. Last 30 seconds of the match, Red Alliance still holds on to their lead. Brashear Bulls Robotics with another cube scored. Very consistent scoring machine. They now look to join their two Alliance partners with two seconds left on the clock. Blue Alliance levels out and time expired. It can wins the match very close, 108 to 95. That was some excellent gameplay by both alliances.